Virgo. The Venus energy is very strong in your chart right now and is going to be over the next few weeks. So first of all, start of this week, it's like in this area, this solar six house, this is your area of the chart. It's the area, it's the house that you represent. Um, so in this sense, in the solar chart, we've got Venus, Mars and Saturn here. It's great for getting organized, all right? So the Saturn helps you get organized, the Mars does too. The Mars like helps to push you forward, even though Mars and Saturn are totally different energies. Like Mars wants to like just go forward full speed, Saturn wants to pull back, be cautious and look things over. So, you know, with work, so there's two areas that are covered in this area of your chart. One is just work, getting organized, productivity, getting systems set. The other one is is the other one is looking after yourself though it's your health and well-being okay so when you're doing your like and if you didn't do goals this year then this is the perfect time to do that okay because the Saturn energy helps you set down long-term goals like, and the Mars just helps you like think quick you know it really gets into there and in, in your mind and gives you that that ability to think on your feet and you know to get like quick insights. Venus being here as well, that's about looking after yourself, but it's also on the business level about financial management. So, you know, before Venus moves out, which is going to move out this, um, this week, uh, pretty well, you know, midweek, um, start to midweek. So before that, at the start of this week, is a great time just to get organized. And if you've got sort of financial management that you want to do, do and get organized, then that is a great week. You are the king and queen of systems, all right? It's what keeps your life in order. So you want to work on resetting your, your systems, resetting your daily, um, you know, what do you do in the morning? What do you want to achieve? Make sure that, <laughs> okay, here's the thing. Thing. Make sure you don't put too much in each day, okay? Um, because you know you love to do that. You, you know you always think we all all our earth signs are the same. I'm in Capricorn. We always think we can do more than what is physically possible in that day, and it does help you strive forward. But you know it can be somewhat overwhelming too. So. <clears throat> I would caution you or suggest to you to just be more um, realistic about what you can achieve and put that in, put it in there. I mean, there's going to be another day after tomorrow and another week after next week. So, you know, if it doesn't work out in that time, you can move it forward. And just on that, I don't know whether you've heard of Evernote. Here's a plug for Evernote. Um, I use Evernote for my to-do list. It's like excellent. In fact, I've got it looking like a piece of art. Um, you can color code it, put tables in there, put check boxes. It's excellent for, you know, even just goal setting, but just to do like your daily today. So nothing falls through the cracks. So I'm sure there's other systems too, but that's the one I use and it works really well for me. So you could have a look at something like that which will help you get organized. Now when Venus moves through this week it's going to move into your love zone. So <laughs> are you looking for love? Um, if you are then you know over this next month it's going to be an excellent time for you to get out. So once again you know right now it's about focusing on your health and well-being, mind, body, spirit, feeling good about yourself and then as Venus moves into the love zone um, you know the better you feel about yourself the, the better that you can um, you know the more you give to yourself the more that you can give to others uh, so um, and Mercury is in the area of uh, finances very good for investments with news and knowledge on that level as well all right I hope you have a great week Thanks for watching. Love and vision to you. If you enjoyed this video, please share it. I've just come back to YouTube and of course now I'm rebuilding my subs. Thanks so much. Bye for now.